No, I'm not going to put a shirt on. If you're a dude and get a little chub down there, that's not my problem. That's your problem. Um, I'm just going to remind you guys that I'm going to have a video up. Not this weekend, but the next weekend on Patreon. Proving that I give to the homeless. Uh, it's because I want to show that atheists are also good people. And a lot of atheists will like sit around and like talk about how Christians are so sucky, like Bill Maher or just any regular fucking person. But you know, Bill Maher's sitting on a stack of a hundred million dollars, and if he gave away fifty million to the homeless, it might actually do something for Los Angeles. But no, you don't see these greedy fuckers doing that. Liberals, conservatives, centrists, it doesn't really matter. Uh, Jeff Bezos, who owns Amazon, has a hundred ten million a billion. Uh, and he gave away a hundred million to help the homeless. Ooh, if he actually solved it for twenty billion or thirty billion, which would be to house every homeless person permanently for the rest of their lives, ooh, he might only be as rich as Mark Zuckerberg. Oh, heaven to Betsy. Fuck these rich fucks. You know what I mean? Money controlling things, and I ain't about that. About Bernie Sanders becoming president of the United States. Uh, I will vote for Yang, and I will vote for Warren, and I would vote for Tulsi Gabbard, but I don't think she's going to win, unfortunately. Uh, no one else. I'm not a blue no matter who person. I'm Democratic Socialist in this election, because I feel that Democratic Socialism in maybe a couple hundred years will get us to anarcho-communism. I'm sure you can Google that shit. What was I saying? What was I saying? What was I saying? Oh! <coughs> Yeah, so there's going to be a video of me giving to the homeless while they're sleeping because I don't want to show their faces. Do you understand? Because that would be doxing them. And I don't want to do that. I think that's egomaniacal and rude. But I'm going to show you me giving food to the homeless. I kind of think I don't get along with some atheists because uh, they don't really like give of themselves and they're, they're rude towards me and hostile towards me. Christians are way more hostile. Don't worry about that. But even the atheists tend to be a bit hostile towards me. Uh, the whole, like, fuck you. I'm only going to be your friend if you stick around while I'm fucking this dude. Uh, these chicks, I don't know about them. It's all age phobia to me. It's not sexism. It's age phobia. Uh, they could do that, but I'm not going to stick around and just be your friend while you're fucking some guy. I'm all about platonic friendships and romantic relationships. That's fine. But if we start a friendship and you don't have a boyfriend, but as soon as we meet you have a boyfriend and you're not even going to give me a chance, I have a thing. You know, it's like if you're not if I if you're not interested in me and we have simply become friends now, I'm not really interested in you. I'll be your friend, but I want to know uh, actually, I don't want to know. I don't want to know why you won't date me. Uh, if you're like 18 to 24 and I'm uh, 40, today is actually my birthday. Uh, I'm going to chalk it up to age phobia because of the telomere shit that I've laid down. It's all on Patreon. You can read the titles of the articles that I posted, uh, but you can't read the articles themselves. Uh, I titled them something different so you couldn't just Google them. There are a lot of stuff I've already posted and some new stuff. But if you go to Patreon, you can see the telomere thing. Kind of fit in the picture together why dudes my age need to date women between 18 and 24 in order to confer the greatest health in their, in their babies. It's all science. It's all based in science. It's like National Institutes of Health stuff and PubMed peer-reviewed scholarly articles. I don't really care about your opinion. It's not about sexism. This is about their age phobia. And I think that age phobia is generated by the corporate powers that be, which is the patriarchy. Um, but the point of this video is to tell you that look for something. I think it's the 6th. Is that Friday? So on the 6th or the 7th, look for a video of me giving food to the homeless while they're asleep. I will not show their faces.